In today's Apex Vaulting video, we're gonna talk about meat adjustments. All pole vault coaches have three roles. One, you teach skill. Think about almost like a karate instructor who has to get their athlete from white belt to black belt, master skill. Two, strength and conditioning. You have to know something about how to get your athletes stronger and faster. And three, you have to be good at adjustments at the meets. You don't teach at a meet, you adjust. Like this post says, meets are all about adjustments. Think about NASCAR crew chiefs. They don't teach their drivers how to drive at the Daytona 500. Those drivers already know how to drive. They have to manage them. You have to manage your athletes at meets. Don't worry about teaching at meets. Just make the adjustments. So what adjustments can you make at a meet? One, you can adjust your athlete's step. You wanna make sure that your athlete is at the right spot on the runway. They're not too far out, they're not too close. Two, pole stiffness. Are they on the right pole? Is their pole too stiff or too soft? Three, grip. Are they gripping too low or too high? Four, standards. Do they have to move up or back? In the following videos, I'm gonna take you step-by-step step through the adjustments I made with one of my athletes at Apex Vaulting at one of their meets. Here we have Sydney opening at 10 feet. That's her opening bar. The standards are at 22. She ends up hitting a really tight mid, which is 40 feet, six inches, clears 10 super easy. Um, but because she's tight, I end up moving her back a foot and we go up a pole knowing that once she hits back a foot, she's gonna really move this pole. So um, didn't mention her grip was at 11.4 on the last bar. We kept that the same. Um, this is up a pole. She hits that foot further back, almost blows through the 35. Um, so we end up going up another pole and we even went up two fingers grip um, up to 11.6 for the next bar. Okay, so now we're up to 11. These are all first attempt makes. She hits a 42 mid a little bit further out, moves the pole real well, clears 11 very easily. Um, we kept everything the same for the next bar. She had won the meet, so uh, we put the bar to a PR. It's a one inch PR, 11.4. She ends up hitting 41.6, runs better, and wow, big blow through that pole bent a lot. So we ended up going up a pole for her second attempt at 11.4, kept everything else the same. All right, here's her second attempt at 11.4. Um, she hits a 41.6 mid. Um, Big make, but almost comes down on it. Um, so I move her back a half because of that 41.6 mid, and I move the standards into 20 um, to jump at the next bar, uh, which we chose 11.7. Now her first attempt at 11.7, she comes down and she hits that half back. She hits a 42 mid. She comes down a lot more room, big blow through. Um, the only thing is, we don't have a 127150. So the next pole up was a 13140 which we went to, but she has never jumped on 13 foot poles before. The thing is, it's 5 pounds up, it makes sense. So that's what we did. So here she is on the 1340 again. She's never jumped on 13 foot poles, but this is the next 5 pounds. She actually hits a little bit tight, 416 and doesn't quite move the pole enough, but it, it looked good. Uh, now we just moved her back a half. Hopefully she hits a better mid on the, on the third and final attempt. All right, we moved her back a half. As she comes down the runway, we see she hits a 42 mid. Big jump and really, really close attempt. That's awesome. Remember, teach skills at practice, make adjustments at meets. The athlete that you just watched, she doesn't have a perfect jump. I like a lot of the things that she does, but it's not perfect. I'm not going to be able to change her jump at the meet. I just have to make adjustments. Make sure that the grip, pole, step, and standards are adjusted appropriately so she has the best chance to clear a bar. I hope this video helped you understand the kind of adjustments that you need to be making at meets. Um, as always, email us at apexvaulting at gmail.com if you have any comments or questions. Um, check out our website, apexvaulting.com. If you live in the Northern Jersey area and are looking to improve your pole vault technique, make sure to sign up for our summer sessions.